Here are the biggest headlines on Pop Sugar right now. Britney Spears and new boyfriend David Licata were spotted in Las Vegas this weekend. The two were seen shopping, laughing, and eating together with friends. On Sunday, they attended a Shania Twain concert at Caesars Palace with Britney's manager, Larry Rudolph. This trip is once again fueling the rumors that Britney is planning on creating her own Vegas show. Tilda Swinton gave some museum goers in New York City quite the surprise celebrity sighting this weekend in a special collaboration with New York's Museum of Modern Art. Tilda will be intermittently, intermittently sleeping in a glass box for a public viewing. This is not the first time Tilda has napped publicly. The exhibit is called The Maybe, which Tilda first created in 1995 back in London. The MoMA has said Tilda will perform the piece at unannounced times and different locations in the museum throughout the rest of the year. Jessica Simpson's daughter, Maxwell, stole her mother's spotlight this weekend. The adorable 11-month-old was at a press event with her mom and Aunt Ashley Simpson in Charlotte, North Carolina. The women were there to promote Jessica and Ashley's girls' collection, but Maxwell was the one getting most of the attention. Giselle Buchen and husband Tom Brady were also seen having a little baby fun on the beach in Costa Rica. Giselle and Tom brought the whole family. Their daughter Vivian had fun playing and in the sand and even went in the water with mom and dad. Tom's boys Jack and Benjamin were also spotted having a blast. As the day went on, Giselle and Tom rested under an umbrella and showed a little PDA. You can check out all of these exclusive pictures on PopSugar.com. Our main story right now, romance with Robert Pattinson, girl time with Selena and Katie, and a little bit of slime. Here to catch us up on all things Kristen Stewart is entertainment editor, Lindsay Miller. Welcome, Lindsay. Hey, Matt. So let's start with Robert and Kristen. Sure. They're reunited. Robert was in Australia filming The Rover, the Rover and... Kristen never really visited. He was there for quite a few months, and some people thought that was trouble, but it doesn't seem like that was the case at all. Right. I think he was just hard at work because now that they're both back in L.A., we've seen them out together a lot recently. They had a little bit of a low-key karaoke night last week, and they stopped and took a picture with a fan. They also celebrated Katy Perry's assistant Tamara's birthday. She's a good friend of Kristen's. Yes. And then Friday night, they went out solo for a little bit of a date night. We actually have exclusive photos of that up on PopSugar.com. They were looking very cute on Friday, yeah. very casual in their hoodies. And then it became kind of a girls weekend. Yeah, absolutely. Kristen was at the Kids' Choice Awards, as we know. And in the audience, she hung out a little bit with Katy Perry and Selena Gomez. There was a really cute photo of Kristen sitting in Katy's lap. And in true Kristen style, in the audience, she had a chance to sit down and she had her Christian Louboutins in her hand, hands rather than on her feet. She never likes yeah. to keep those <laughs> shoes on, does she? It's true. Yeah. And then she won two awards. Yeah, she did. She won Best Female Butt Kicker in the languages. A little <laughs> Love light these here titles. because the Kids' yes. Choice Awards, of yeah. course. And she also won Favorite Movie Actress. She was one of the rare people who did not get slimed, although she said she wished she had. But she did thank all the Twilight fans during her acceptance speech. Take a look. This is really cool. I, I really appreciate it. Twilight fans have been, like, overwhelmingly amazing forever. And uh, I, had a, I had a shirt. <laughs> What, whatever. I had a shirt in kindergarten. Um, it said, kick butt first, take names later. So thank you very much for honoring me in this way. I feel like I finally realized my kindergartner self. So thanks, guys. And what a fun award show that oh, was. Oh, absolutely. Is. Always really fun. I mean, you get slimed at this award it's, show. Who doesn't <laughs> want to get slimed, right? Thanks, <laughs> thanks so much, Matt. Lindsay. Thank you.